guys, it's your boys, Duos, and I'm back at it with another video. Guess what? Andy's back. I'm back, bitch. Today for you guys, we're a guess who said that quote. So basically, we're gonna get quotes ready for one another, and the other person's gotta guess who said it. Because there's so many people that have so many famous quotes, it would be unfair to just make them guess that one person. We're gonna make the game multiple choice. We're gonna have four options, and one of them will be the right answer, and then the other three will obviously be the wrong answer. Without further ado, let's get started. <laughs> Alright guys, now that we're sitting down and ready to start the challenge, I'm going to begin. Alright, quote number one. This should be interesting. Who said this? Impossible is potential. Impossible is temporary. Impossible is nothing. Was it Albert Einstein, Thomas Edison, Muhammad Ali, or Malcolm X? These are some good ass quotes. Muhammad Ali. Wow! You are right. Yeah, you're right. I was Let's gonna go. Say Let's All right, go. Alright, he got Let's it. Let's go. He got it. He got it. Alright, All right. that's one for him. Here's my quote. I am whatever I say I am. If I wasn't, then why would I say I am? This is, is a song lyric. I am whatever I say I am. If is I wasn't. it Logan Paul? No. Donald Trump? No. Elon Musk? No. Or Eminem? It's Eminem. I am whatever I say I am. If Did I wasn't, then why would I say I okay. am? No, I heard this. Uh, I know the song. Woo! Alright, here we go. Next question. I'm not saying I'm gonna change the world, but I guarantee that I will spark the brain that will. Was it Tupac Shakur, Barack Obama, Biggie Smalls, or me? You? Me. Like as in Brandon Chung, as or is the guy's me, name as me? As in me. Me. Brandon Chung. Okay, you're definitely not that inspirational. Say the quote one time. I'm not saying I'm gonna change the world, but I guarantee that I will spark the brain that will. Tupac, it's Tupac. Obama, it's Tupac. Biggie Smalls, and then me. Tupac. You sure about that? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. You got it right. Yeah, let's go. It's two for two. Alright. So far we're at hundred percent each. That's okay. surely gonna change right here. Here's my second quote. Sometimes life hits you in the head with a brick. Don't lose faith. Oh, okay. Was it Machine Gun Kelly, Tom Cruise, John Legend, All right. or Steve Jobs? Alright, this is Ooh, the two middle ones, I know for a f I'm gonna deduce the hell out of this one. Sky. I know for a fact Machine Gun Kelly would say some shit with like a brick. Like he just seems like the type of guy to do that, right? Then who was the middle two? Tom Cruise and then who else? John Legend, Tom Cruise, Machine Gun Kelly. They would not, I feel like they wouldn't say that. And Steve Jobs, I feel like he's so genius that him saying something stupid would be interpreted as genius. Oh my god. <sighs> Machine Gun Kelly for the win. It was Steve Jobs. Damn it, I Let's knew go. it! I knew it! I knew it! Oh! Alright, you're up, you're up, you're up. Get yours up. Okay, alright, here we go. <sighs> I've missed more than 9,000 shots in my career. I've lost- I already know who this is. I've lost almost 300 games. 26 times I've been trusted to take the game winning shot and missed. I failed over and over and over again in my life and that's why I succeed. Was it Magic Johnson, LeBron James, Wayne Gretzky, or Michael Jordan? Michael Jordan. You sure about that? Positive. I'm, I'm, I'm actually being serious. Are you sure I'm about that? Positive. It was Wayne Gretzky. Was it really? No, it was Michael. Oh, what the f was it? Yeah, no way. I know, because I remember that quote. As soon as you started saying I knew- oh! Let's go! Alright, here's my next song. Here's number three for anger. Get this! I'm so pumped. Let's go. Alright. Truth is everybody's gonna hurt you. You just gotta find the ones worth suffering for. Oh. Was it Muhammad Ali, Bruce Lee, Bob Marley, or Eminem? Bob Marley. Yes! Let's go! I know all of Muhammad Ali's and Bruce Lee's quotes. Your boy had a feeling that was gonna be Bob Marley. So right now, it could be tied if he messes this one up. Not though. I'm all right, not. All right, all right, all right. When the people fear the government, there is tyranny. When the government fears the people, there is liberty. Was it Thomas Jefferson, Benjamin Franklin, George Washington, or Franklin Denor Roosevelt? I think I mispronounced it's his middle name. It's Delano. Alright, yeah, FDR. Was it Thomas Jefferson? Say Franklin? The one more time. Got you. When the people fear the government, there is tyranny. When the government fears the people, there is liberty. Was it Thomas Jefferson, Benjamin Franklin, George Washington, or Franklin? Thomas Jefferson. Hold on, wait. Franklin? Delano. Okay, that's what you said. Delano Roosevelt. Thomas, Thomas Jefferson. You sure? Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Yes, let's go! Four for four! Oh wait, is that game? Does that automatically mean it's game? No, no, I'm Okay, here's my last one. So Brandon needs to get this in order to at least five. I thought you had five. Yeah, this is the fifth. Oh yeah. Oh, no, 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 Wait, okay. If you can dream it, you can do it. <laughs> I've heard this before, once that name is said. Okay, go ahead. Henry Ford, Ronald Reagan, Plato. Plato? You know, like the old, like, Oh, Plato. I thought you meant like, no, like the no, kid's no. toy. I was like, what? Walt Disney. It's my boy Walt Disney for the win. You got it right. Yes! Let's go! 
You're not getting this last one. I hope you realize. Oh, he's so okay. Here we go. I have a you want to tie this up. You want to tie this up. Behind every great man is a woman rolling her eyes. Was it Kevin Hart, Louis C.K., Jim Carrey, or Bill Burr? It's either Bill Burr so, or Louis C.K. Okay. Behind every great. These man. are all comedians, by the way. If you guys don't know, like stand up comedians. A woman rolling her eye. Um. Louis C.K., Bill Burr. No, I'll give the options one more time. Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart. Louis C.K., Jim Carrey, or Bill Burr. I know you're infatuated with Bill Burr. It could also be Kevin Hart, though, because I feel like he has a good marriage. That's something somebody who's close to their wife might say. Good I marriage. feel like Louis C.K. was, like, divorced or something. Or, like, he, he was married once and he, like, divorced his wife. So I feel like, I don't know why he would mention his wife after the divorce. I'm gonna go Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart. You're wrong. It was Jim Carrey. Really? It was Jim Carrey. See, I knew when I did this one, I was like, that's such a twister. <laughs> Oh, let's go! Your boy could potentially win this one. He took the song challenge, but I can win it all right here. Here we go. You can't win it. The quote. You can yeah. tie right now. No, we're tied right now. No, we're not. I'm oh sh. All right. Here's my last quote. Brandon needs us to tie. If he doesn't get this, I win. Your boy wins again. Let's go. Jealousy is just love and hate at the same time. Oh my god. Was it Jesus Christ, John Lennon, Kendrick Lamar, or Drake? I'm gonna throw Jesus out of the picture. I don't think he would, no, that's way too modern sounding to, for that, right? If it was Jesus, it'd be like, jealousy is thou with. Jealousy is thou with. Or you could be playing reverse psychology on me. We got Kendrick and Drake. Jealousy is love and hate at this, and Lennon. And John Lennon. Those are all music. Don't forget John Lennon. Drake, I don't think he would, he would talk about that, right? Kendrick, god damn, Kendrick be coming up with some good ass lyrics, but I've never heard that in one of his songs. Jealousy is just love and hate at the same time. I feel like that's something a hippie would say. I'm going to go for the tie, John Lennon. Your boy can only keep copping those L's. It was Drake. Drake said that. Jealousy is just love and hate at the same time. That's what I meant. I meant Drake. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, Drake. okay. I okay. okay. I said, Fuck you. I, 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 I won, one bro. One more. No, one more. Guys, that was bullshit. All right, guys, two things. One, your boy won again. Brandon's over there. He's weeping. He's crying. Where is he? There he is. There he is. Hi, Brandon. How does that loss taste? How does that loss taste? Tastes pretty good. Ooh, yeah, it tastes I'll pretty good. My so, your boy won the game, but here's a little something. You guys might be wondering why I'm out here on my deck. Let's just say that this deck and this pool can create something that I think would be pretty nuts. <laughs> Jump. <laughs> All right, guys, the man is crazy. There might be a potential video where your boy might jump off his deck into that pool. Okay. I've never done that. I've lived in this house for years. I have actually never done it. I've always thought about doing it. This might be the move, guys. Guys, I might have copped that L today. The past two videos, the past two challenges, this man right here is one. And I guarantee you one thing. Next challenge, bro, I'm taking that no, W. Not a chance. I'm taking that W. Mark my words. I went easy on him with the quotes. Not but I am going to take the next W. That pool, like, it's literally four feet deep. I am six foot four. I'm gonna jump off this ledge right here. You're gonna empty the pool water, bro. I You're going to em empty my, my organs all over. All right, guys, so this is what the jump looks like from ground zero. I'm gonna be jumping from up there into this pool. It's not a deep pool, guys. It is literally four feet. Me standing in it. Oh, there's Brandon. Hi, Brandon. Flex on them haters, Brandon. I love it. If you guys like that video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up. As big as us. <laughs> big in many ways, I guess you could oh. say. Oh. Where oh. it matters. No, okay, I'm just... <laughs> Okay. okay. No, seriously, guys. Gone sexual? If, gone sexual? Yeah, gone sexual. Uh, anyways, guys, if you like that video, please drop a huge thumbs up. And Leave comments for future suggestions for more videos coming on later on because you guys know we're not going to stop. That is it for Duo Zeno. Until next time, we will see you guys later. Peace. <laughs> Touch my body. Behind every okay, great man. What if I just drop this in? Holy shit. Oh my god, that'd be bad. Oh my god, I thought he was actually gonna go. <laughs> I always consider- Oh, shit. Okay. What, booty? Oh, what the fuck? Is there something on my ass or are you just trying to- No, there's something ass? on your ass. What? Move, look, I got you. Cake. <laughs> Can you see inside my nostrils? Boy. <laughs> yeah. Yo, wait, you're touching the freaking lens.